Hi, it's Roxanne, the spooky cat lady of dark whimsical art. And today we're going to take a look at a creepy, creepy coloring book. But before we do that, we need to open door number three. So let's check that out. <laughs> and we put on my witch's hat. <clears throat> and let's see what's behind door number three. Shuffle them around. And now uh, we shall pick. Uh oh, reversed. And what do we have? It's the Five of Swords. I'm sure, I'm getting a lot of swords. So let's see what the Five of Swords means, reversed. Here we go. <clears throat> a battle is over, complete with a winner and losers. Someone is walking away with all the prizes as well as confirmed enemies. Others are walking away with regrets, bad feelings, strong judgments, and probably with a taste of revenge. Although he may not know it yet, the victor has also lost something valuable, perhaps his honor, integrity, values, or friends. This situation is confused, and that makes it hard to know what to do. If it is too late and the battle happens already, make whatever restorations and moves toward peace that you can. If it hasn't happened yet, Try to figure out a better way to solve the conflict. When it's reversed, it'll be a costly victory, dishonor, shameful behavior. So, hmm, there's some kind of battle going on. You might want to rethink it, because it's going to cost you a lot to win, and probably more trouble in the future. Hmm. So that was fun, and now let's look at a coloring book, a horror coloring book. We got Alice's Nightmares in Wonderland. This one's very thin, and that's not a bad thing. The paper inside is also very thin, like printer paper, so you might have a hard time with wetter mediums. 
but I do like the artwork. Oh, that's fun. Falling down the rabbit hole. There's sayings on the each of the back sides, so you're probably not going to ruin um, pages. Just the text. And these are kind of cool. It's kind of got a scheme. We got some swords. A boar. Interesting. Hmm. Is the rabbit dead? Has he been attacked by this clock thing? We got a clockwork raven. Hmm. Some spooky looking mushrooms. And of course, the Cheshire cat. Looking a little bit ferocious. The maze. Guess it's the tea party, but we got a like a robot tea man going on. Some more mechanical beings. tell what that is, but it's pretty amazing looking. Mm, we got an interesting clockwork man. Possibly a werewolf. Maybe even two werewolves. monster. Maybe he's a cyclops? No, he's got four eyes. So... Oh, the Cheshire cat's creepy mouth. We found the queen with somebody's head. There's actually a lot of pages in here. It's just the pages are so thin. It doesn't seem like it. Or if it's been a while, watch it again. It's really, really good. 
And I hope you enjoyed this. Please like and subscribe. And this video.